I'm Tim Macy with eXp Realty in San Antonio, Texas, and my tip for new agents is start documenting from day one. A lot of times uh, when our new agents come in, they don't feel like they know enough to be talking about real estate, right? They're worried about how much they know. Well, my answer to that is start learning right? Be a nerd about real estate. Learn about all of the lending terminology. Learn about all the different things like a 1031 exchange. Become a nerd about all things real estate and tell people about the things you're learning about. So you're not saying here like, hey, I'm an expert on 1031 exchange. No, no, no. You say, hey, look, I'm just learning about 1031 exchange. Isn't it super cool? This is what it is. Did you know that there's a property tax exemption for veterans? Never knew that. Look at this, so I gotta do is fill out this form. Like dive in, become an absolute nerd about real estate and document all the stuff you're learning. Tell your sphere about it because new agents don't give themselves enough credit for how much they already know, right? Like you already know a lot more than the normal consumer about buying real estate. So own it and then just tell people all the cool stuff you're learning. So if you have to get business today, well, good luck. Video's probably not the way to go because video has a longer uh, ROI. So I would be banging on doors if I needed to get business today. I'd go door knock all the neighborhoods and just have something of value, whether it's a, a listing that's coming soon. My favorite thing is uh, to do open houses and have donuts there and like from a cool place too. Don't just go to Dunkies, even though I love Dunkies. Um, go to like the Art of Donut and you go and you knock on the door and you say, hey, look, uh, I'm having an open house tomorrow and I've got two dozen of these like gourmet donuts and if you don't come I'm gonna have to eat them all myself and I don't need that in my life right now so do me a favor bring the kids the kids always love the donuts please just help me out come eat some donuts right not like hey will you come check out my open house have you ever thought about buying and selling no it's like hey look and, and the other thing is I'm jogging right because I like to run when I throw these door hangers so I'll be like running and then I'll throw the door hanger I'll knock on the door somebody else but Hey, I'm doing an open house tomorrow. I'd love if you came. I got these donuts and I'm trying to lose weight, so I need help eating the donuts. Come by, bring the kids. I'll be there from like 11 to three. We'd love to see you. The donuts are amazing. Have you tried them yet? Art of Donut, they're ridiculous. They got Oreos on them, they're spectacular. I'll see you there. Awesome, great, boom. That's how you get people into the open house and then hopefully you can get a deal. Yeah, 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 I'm focusing on focusing because I have so much squirrel syndrome. Um, YouTube and being more tactical and strategic with the content, but not making it seem like I am, right? Like, I know internally uh, that we're gonna be a little bit more strategic with the content that we put out um, and putting out more local content that ties into the real estate content, but I don't wanna come out that way because people I think like my stuff because it's very organic and it's just like whatever I'm doing and that's a great thing to have but we are gonna start looking at YouTube and some of these other platforms and really how to optimize a better content strategy. Wait, wait, before you leave, I wanna share some more tips and tricks that we're using in our business to take it to that next level. Just click right here. And don't forget to subscribe, click right here.